Hey guys, what's up, Sandra? And what you're about to watch is one of the most epic plays in Castle Wars in history. This is probably the most epic Castle Wars kind of situation you'll ever see for the rest of your life. Um, I had just gotten an Abyssal Whip and um, Piety. I'll have some videos on how I got those coming soon. But so I figured, why not have some fun? Head to Castle Wars, you know. Um, I'd just done my SAT earlier in the day, so I uh, was ready to. to you know, poon some noobs in Castle Wars, as you see here, getting a, uh, a quick flag right at the beginning of the game. But this is a pretty epic clip, as if you ever played Castle Wars, you know that sometimes people will get their own flag after killing a uh, someone who tried to capture it, and they'll try to kind of tank it out till the end of the game with the flag, and uh, I was not going to let that happen. This guy had, the, had his own flag, and I was going to make sure I would get it and kill him, and bring it back to the base to score the point for our team. So, uh, enjoy, guys. So as you see right there, guys, that was a pretty fucking amazing uh, play. I think I uh, the D Halley worked out really well. A lot of people don't um, expect how powerful the Dragon Halberd is and how much damage it, it can deal. Um, as you saw right there, I hit a 34 with it, and I was using Chivalry even though I have Piety. I use Chivalry because it for sometimes because it has a much slower drain rate than Piety. Although uh, Piety would still make me hit quite a bit higher, so that could have been like a 35, 36 with Piety. And also, I'm not 99 strength, I'm only 74. I was super strength potted, but not fully, so, you know, what the D-Heli can hit with that just one hit is incredible. And of course, if you use the D-Heli spec on a, a bigger monster, it hits twice, just like a DDS. So, the anchor's great, the whip's great, although you gotta give mad respect to the Dragon Halberd for, uh, you know, pulling that one out there. The extra attack range you get, which makes it like a ranged weapon, is just incredibly useful and it really does throw people off guard. And maybe it would even be good for BKing, I really have yet to try that. Um, but I've been primarily focusing on the anchor, so... You know, Castle Wars is always fun, and when you, uh, when you bring a bunch of different weapons and you have pretty high combat, it can be a real blast, so... Um, enjoy playing Castle Wars, guys. Join Andrew AJT62 Friend Chat. Uh, click the like button if you enjoyed this video. It takes a lot of work to uh, to get these videos up for you guys, so I'd appreciate just a quick like and also subscribe if you haven't already. So thanks for watching, guys. Again, join the friend chat, and I will uh, see you guys soon. Thanks for watching.